last week on Flip Brother. You know, one of the things I'm kind of worried about is the area. Um, I'm afraid someone's going to come in and steal the work. You know, yeah, stuff. I'd have to kind of disagree with them. Man, they ripped it. Get, get a shot of this. They got the copper here. Oh, what's going on? We got water. I think they're still here. Oh, TV's I, off. They tried to steal the TV here. too. All right, I'm uh, coming up to our project here in Vincennes. I got a call from Josh uh, telling me we had two break-ins. Um, it's one of those things where, you know, uh, we got to get these properties more secure and um, get alarms on them and stuff. So uh, some of the copper was ripped out. And so that's going to just add some more cost to our budget. Um, so th this is a great up and coming area, but it doesn't mean that it's a safe area. And especially for rehabbing, um, you got a bunch of guys always trying to steal copper because for them it's, uh, it's their way of living. Um, we don't agree with it, but um, it's what people do, especially uh, with the economy still being the way it is. Um, but uh, yeah, I gotta see with Josh what's going on. Um, he's gonna show me. Uh, we got some contractors coming later today. Um, oh, there he is. He's waiting for me. So. so, there's pretty much nothing you can do, huh? Alright, well, um, thanks, I guess. Okay, bye. Uh, so, it's a safe neighborhood, huh? E yeah, I just got off the phone with the police and they said there's nothing they can really do unless somebody died. So. Uh, how much is this going to cost us? All the break-ins and all the extra copper we got stolen, it's probably going to be another three grand. Okay, so you're you're making a big deal about the staircase to me because it's going to be three to five. Oh, that's going to be five grand. This okay. is three grand. Oh, well, yeah, two thousand dollars difference. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so now we get two break-ins since. Yeah. Since we secured secured the property. Yeah, well, I, I, they need to do a better job in the future. All right, well, you want to show me where they broke in? Yeah, let's go take a look. Yeah, so, as you can see, the entire door is missing right now. What up, man? Yeah, they did Didn't a number we secure this with two-by-fours and stuff? No, that... uh, we had two-by-fours, steel. It didn't really matter. I mean, you can see here the entire frame for the door is gone. Oh, wow. Yeah. Man. They did a, these are all, oh, wow, these are the old square nails. This is, yeah. wow. Uh, and they even busted, busted the out screws. the screws. This yeah. didn't make a difference here. Okay. So, yeah, they really took a lot of. Did you talk to the neighbors at all? Yeah, I talked to the neighbors. They said they heard like a loud banging last night and they just figured somebody was getting robbed, so they didn't do they, anything. They didn't do anything? <laughs> That's where we're at, so. Let's go uh, take a look. Uh, wasn't in a great area, that's what you were telling me. Thanks. Yeah, now now we gotta get this secured again. Yeah. Let's take a look. Yeah, right here. I don't know what they did here. Well, they left our PVC piping, but that was oh, that's nice. Place anyway. Yeah. But all the copper's definitely gone. Oh man, it looks like they ripped into here. They cut that. Yeah. Oh, wow. Did they do this too? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they're trying to do. They need a drywall or something. Huh. So they must have taken the drywall we had in here from the workers. Okay. What about the copper anywhere else? Yeah, the copper throughout the house. We'll go take a look upstairs and take a look at the damage. I don't know if they were trying to get out of the porch for something. I mean, they were really looking for stuff here. Wow. Yeah. I'll show you in here. They uh. The reason they did this is because the front was secured. Oh. So that way it allowed them to go upstairs, is my guess. Wow. Because the front doors weren't broken. Okay. You walk in here, and you notice all the vents for the furnace, for the floor vents, are all missing. And if you look even here, there's like an old uh, Folgers can or Maxwell oh, wow. house. Yeah. Back in the Depression days, people used to store their money under these vents, so they, that's what they were looking for, and they also took the cast iron and like, scrap that. So. Okay. Yeah, I mean, all of them are missing. Wow. Yeah. That's, like gonna, be, that's gonna be a safety hazard for uh, Yeah, our workers are all gonna fall in, or even our cameramen. 
Yeah, maybe the cameraman will fall in. I don't know. <laughs> Careful, cameraman. So, um, here in the bathroom, you can see they, just to get to the copper, look at that, they busted out the entire vanity. Get a uh, shot of this. Oh, man. Now we got to run all this copper. Yeah, now we got to do all new copper. And the stuff. city won't let us grandfather it in. Now we got to, like, kind of upgrade the entire system. Oh, they did it here, too? And so, in the kitchen, you can see. Man, they were the countertop, everything. Yeah. Now they, we we're gonna they use took it. the Formica countertop and they... We are going to use these cabinets for our rentals. It looks like not anymore. No, they completely so. destroyed it to get to this copper. Wow. So, what it was, the reason why they didn't take it here is because water was blowing everywhere, so... Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm like, why is there still copper there? Okay. Yeah, and you said we didn't need an alarm. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Tell least, money. you got to be wrong one time in your life. Huh. Yeah. I guess so. Uh, did they take anything upstairs? Yeah, we'll go take a look. Alright, so we got to keep this staircase here now. We're, we're way over budget with all this damage throughout the house. Alright, so you are wrong about the alarm system. I think you're wrong about the staircase. No, no. I, I've only been wrong once in my life and that was the time. But look at this. They took our fireplace. So this is going to be another $5,000 if we replace it. Oh, no. So, I say we just cover it and be done with it. I, I, it just, we'll have a fireplace. That was going to be a nice feature, a bedroom with a fireplace. Yeah. I mean, could you imagine walking in here and having a fireplace in here? Yeah, it would have been nice. But, All right, uh, well, we'll fill it in, I guess. Man. Yeah. So, what else? They still copper up here, too? Yeah, they got all the copper in that. In the bathroom, so you can take oh, a look in there. Oh, come on, man. So here, see things. now we we have to move it. Yeah, now I'm now that cost. we're yeah we're gonna save the money there. So what? Look at that. Well, at least they they used cement board whenever they did this bathroom. They did that right. Yeah. You sometimes see it where they don't put in the cement board. So yeah, luckily but, this upstairs didn't have any copper in the kitchen so they really didn't rip that apart so that's really? about all of the extent up here so in total this is going to cost us six thousand dollars with the robbery and copper and the furnace so we're already over our budget okay let's just do some math all right alarm system five hundred dollars yeah then you got your monthly charge twenty five dollars a month okay so we hold this on this for six months that comes out to what a buck fifty yeah so total investment for an alarm system, 650 to 700 Okay. Well, I thought this was a better neighborhood that we didn't need that, but I guess I was wrong. Well, uh, I mean, who told you it was such a good neighborhood? Well, the neighbors told me it was a good neighborhood. They're <laughs> yeah, probably they're... the ones that probably robbed us. Oh, yeah, they're just trying to keep your car down. So yeah. uh, anyways, I come up with a solution. All right. Kind of recoup that from the budget. All right, yeah, I'm, I'm up for money saving ideas. What do you got? <laughs> I don't think you're going to like this. What do you mean? <laughs> I brought a nice big sledgehammer. What's that for? Well, why don't you take a feel of that? Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, guess what? You're going to be doing some demo work. What do you mean I'm going to be doing demo work? I'm wearing a suit. Yeah. Well, the construction guys are coming right now, but you're going to help with the demo. I would have better prepared if I knew I was doing demo. I told you not to wear your suit today. Well, you didn't tell me why. I don't have to. Just listen next time. Giving you the first honors of busting the first wall open on this house. Right. You watch that you want. I want to use the axe. There you go. Oh, we found a vent right here. 
Thank you. Thank you.